Meanwhile, some body camera video from the moment police found a man with a gun hiding near an apartment complex. Officers believe they stopped a violent robbery thanks to an eagle-eyed neighbor who called 911. Channel 2's Gwinnett County Bureau Chief Tony Thomas live now near Peachtree Industrial Boulevard with really, I mean, the dramatic arrest. And Tony, you've been digging also into the gunman's background. Yeah, George, and he has quite a long rap sheet. That's what makes it all more nerve-wracking for residents here of this apartment complex and for police, for that matter, too, because it was dark when they arrived here and got that 911 call. They had no idea who they were looking for or where he might be back in here exactly. In fact, at one point on that body cam video, police appear to walk right past his hiding spot. Why was he even here if he doesn't live here? Yeah. It's scary. As Sabrina and Rose left their Duluth apartment, they were surprised when I told them about the overnight drama just outside their doorstep. It's usually very quiet. Not one night last week when another resident spotted the masked gunman hiding in the nearby bushes. And when I look to my left, I see a dude with a mask on and a gun. He just ended up chilling. Like he waiting somebody out. Officers arrived and soon found 28-year-old Armani Alice. Hey, 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 oh, 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 don't put your hands in your Pocket. High point 38. Turns out Duluth police are familiar with Allen. This is body cam video from August 2017. Officers arrested and charged Allen after bank tellers say he walked into this Wells Fargo bank, claimed he had a bomb, and walked out with six grand. He was found minutes later walking down the street, money in a plastic bag. I looked into his past and found several charges in Gwinnett County alone, dating back to 2011. He also served a short prison stint for a crime in DeKalb County. So he never gave a reason why he was there. No, 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 listen to me. I can, I, I can get in there. I can get in. Get in what? I can get in. Get in what? Into drug cartel. But we're glad they caught him. We're glad they caught him. <coughs> and Duluth police say this is a perfect example of why they say it is good for people to call 911 and report suspicious activity. Officers convinced guys that if they hadn't shown up within four or five minutes like they did here, if that guy hadn't called 911, they uh, probably would have been a violent crime. Live in Duluth, Tony Thomas, Channel 2 Action News. And Tony, these are the moments that remind us that if we see something, we truly have to say something. Thank you.